the latest efforts to get Wisconsin residents vaccinated against COVID-19. Health officials report today that just over 40 percent of the state's population has gotten at least one dose. Just under 28 percent have now been fully vaccinated. New at five, some Milwaukee Common Council members are pushing for more information about the Johnson & Johnson COVID-19 vaccine. Tony Atkins was at a meeting today and he reports from the Wisconsin Center. Alders Malele Coggs and Russell Stamper introduced this topic saying they wanted to know more about how the city's health department administered the now paused vaccine. How many people had the vaccine and if they were notified were just some of the questions the committee had today. The Johnson & Johnson vaccine was pulled temporarily following FDA and CDC recommendations. It was tied to six cases of rare blood clots here in the U.S., all women in other states. The Milwaukee Health Department says it administered Johnson & Johnson to more than 1,500 people here in the city. Is the health department doing any outreach to individuals who have received it or, or not? So we've con contacted all the organizations that received it and advised them to, to tell the people who they had. In some cases, the organizations registered people on their own, so they have contacts. The city's health department says if you made it past the two week post vaccination period with the Johnson and Johnson vaccine, you should be OK. Reporting in Milwaukee, Tony Atkins, TMJ4 News.